Bah. Waste of time. Maybe someone snuck something into the loo over here. <laughs> no, I am seeing nada. Too bad there. Well, let's continue on then. Looks like we're in the clear for now. now this is a nice looking area. Hmm. Perhaps something is in here. Maybe even behind a bookcase. What's this? Ah. And that's definitely not something I can take with me. I think we can turn this on ourselves. Yep. So as you can see, it's quite easy for those things to be turned on by guards, considering that Garrett can just turn it on without any tinderbox or anything. Just turn the gas on and it sparks itself, I guess. Not a uh, very good thing to have available to guards if you're trying to sneak through dark passageways. Hmm. Seems to be about it. Oh well. My hopes for more loot are dashed. Still, there was a good bit of loot in here. Pretty looking door. Oh, please tell me one of these coat hooks turns. Aww. I was really hoping for a secret coat hook. That would have been kind of cool. Of course, I'm not sure where the door would open or what would open if I were to turn a coat hood like that because there's not really anything around it to open. Alright, back in the large area. Definitely a doorway over there. Hopefully no one is going to come out of that doorway anytime soon. Rather open here. Oh, come now. There we go. I've got sort of a hidden place. Hmm. I really wonder where that fireplace that uh, was downstairs actually led up to, because it's not here. I don't see any grate under that. Got a vase. Anything else up here? <laughs> Handle. Oh, that's noisy. Whoa, now. Don't want to fall. Nothing. And... What is that? Ooh. New objectives. What is this? What would a wedding be without rings? Get two for Basso and Genevieve. Bonus objective. Awesome. Nice little set of rings for us. I like it. Alright. Time to get across here and hope that we do not have any issues with guards. Because I'm rather open right now. Nothing so far. I need to make it into one of these rooms, though. Uh-oh. Um, maybe not coming over this way. can definitely still hear him, though. Ooh. Who's over there? No one? Nice little shaded area here. Uh, well, back to work. Uh oh. There is definitely a guard coming over this way. Let's get ready for him to get close. And. Gotcha. 
Let's take you in here for a moment. At least you'll be out of the way. Hmm. Quick little search around for something dazzlingly sparkly. And that has netted me nothing. How disappointing. All right, then. Hmm. Watch it. Saw something there. No, you didn't. Trust me. Not as exciting as I thought. It's never as exciting as you thought. Especially when you get bashed on the head when you're not thinking about it. Cook said we might get stew today. With real mm. cow. Stew. But the Baron gets to eat cows all the time. <clears throat> I bet you he does. <clears throat> then again, he's probably a little bit more alert than you are. <clears throat> Who knows, maybe he's not. Maybe he's passed out somewhere. Just like you. Maybe he won't be waking up for a long, long time. This looks nice. I will certainly add it to my nice little pack. Anything? No. Anyone home? Does not seem to be. Hmm. Why, hello there. You shan't be hiding from me. Anything else like that? I would enjoy finding more like that. No, that seems to be it for here. Now, here's one of the uh, newer mechanics in uh, Thief 2. And that is the capability to turn on and off lights. It has a nice little chiming noise, too. We don't really need to turn off the light in here, so I'll leave that be. What do we have here? Just a random plant? Nothing of interest. Hello? Anyone home up here? I suppose not. Perhaps there's some loot up here that's uh, still home. I would enjoy that. So far, nothing. How disappointing. I suppose I could use a flare in here to light things up, and you can check out what it looks like. Nifty little gadget. Not the best thing to carry around with you um, when you're trying to stay hidden, but great to look around places. Seems to be another empty room. Why, hello. Looks like that uh, tiara had enough gems in it for us to uh, be finished looking for gems. Doesn't mean I'm finished looking for loot, though. Let's just back outside. Ooh. Nice little ring there. And I can't really see behind there. All right. <clears throat> I suppose we're done with up here. Now to check out the rest of this place. Hmm. Anything good? It would seem the answer is no.
And this is back the way we came, I believe. Yes. So we could definitely go get Basso right now. And he could um, certainly get in here. But we have one last door to check out. Which happens to have a guard in it. Let's see here. Let's pull out a nice little flash bomb. This could definitely assist me in taking him out. Because he is quite far across the room for me to be able to get to him. Uh, hello? Hello! Also, as you can see, um, we get Come flashed too, fight! which can be a pain in the ass that uh, we also get flashed just like guards. <laughs> you can try um, turning away from the flash, which will um, help a little bit. The other thing that you can do is uh, lean around a door, toss a flash into a room, and uh, then just lean back and it misses your eyesight altogether. And it looks like there was no particular reason to actually come in here other than taking out that guard. This is where that dumb waiter was. And that is all there is to this place. Oh well. Now we shall check out this front area here, which has a nice double door. Let's see here. Key, key, key. There we go. To meet up with. Just don't hear them no more. And he's talking about birds. So as you can see we now have a nice little archer walking around the place and um, it's kind of hard to tell but he's actually got an arrow in his pack and you could um, loot that off of him which counts as a uh, pickpocket. Of course he is um, walking around on some very very noisy flooring which is going to make it extremely difficult to uh, to actually get up on him. There are the two guards over here, and I don't believe there is any particular method of getting out here secretly <laughs> enough to get both of them without being seen. I could try. I certainly could try. I do have extra flash bombs if the occasion is necessary. Well, I have one flash bomb. <clears throat> Just hold for a little bit for this guy to go around and see if we can't make some new friends for Mr. Jack. Smooth over there. Yeah, that's not working out at all. Oh well, back to work. Never mind. That would probably fail immediately. So we are not going to even bother with that. All right, I believe we have. Uh, Hey, I've been in there. I don't know why that's not lit up. We have, in general, looked at everything there is to find in this place. Certainly looks like it, and that's where Genevieve is. Genevieve, whatever you want to call her. You can also write notes here if you're uh, interested in doing it, and I believe you can do them on your map as well. Yes. So, if there's something that you find on the map that you want to come back to later, you can always mark it on the map just like that. I couldn't really do that when I was recording the first Thief game, mainly because you guys wouldn't have been able to see it and it just would have been silly. But now I can show you the map and it's all pretty. 
All right. Off to Ye Olden Courtyard once again. And... To a very, very, very bad place to be sneaking through. Because I want what's in the middle. Which is quite silly of me and quite greedy as well. Um... I don't know if it was wise to walk out here when I did, but I'm going to do it anyway. Doo -doo -doo. Careful now. Don't want that. Cheese. And now, a little sneaky sneak. As this guy patrols the yard again. like a moron. He does have a key on him, it looks like. Mm, but he nothing, can keep that key. Oh, well. I imagine I could get some more Hello? pickpocketing if I was willing to be silly and follow these guards. Alright. I cannot go in there. Hey, Basso! Let's go. Good Basso. Little faster, buddy. I think I could knock you out and carry you there faster. Of course, you wouldn't be able to pick the lock if you were knocked out, so that would probably be a bad thing. Hmm. I wonder if I can open this. Why, well, yes, yes, I can. Hello, guards that I knocked out. You will not be awake for a while. Alright, I am going to quick save here. And the reason I'm going to do that is because I want to try to get in to the room that Basso is going to open. I don't know if I will be capable of doing so, but I am certainly going to try. I should probably check if Basso's actually coming. That guy is kind of a moron. Making it okay? Good job, Basso. Alright, let's see if I can't slightly get in front of him and let him uh, pick this door while I'm here. Perfect. Now I want in. Yes! There's a key. Basso! Shh, come with me. Are you telling me that she had a key for this room the entire time? No. You are not closing this door. Yes. Are you serious? Did not have to pick it at all because she had a key in her room. What a bunch of silly people. Well, so much for loot. Guess I don't need that at the moment. Shh, come with me. Did you already say that? All right. Well, we got all of our objectives just fine. Let's check out our stats. We took almost an hour to do this, and we found uh, 1205 out of 1285. Oh well, we're missing 80 of the loot. I have no idea where that might be. Picked five pockets out of ten. There would have been two pockets if I uh, took the archer's arrow and the key off of him, and then I imagine those other two were archers, so possibly keys and arrows. We found all the secrets, though.
Anyway, next time we will be continuing on with Thief 2, The Metal Age. I'll see y'all later.